far as ISIS is concerned, uh, its origins lie in the U.S.-British invasion of Iraq. Uh, in fact, uh, one of the leading uh, uh, U.S. specialists on the Middle East, uh, Graham Fuller, long background in CIA other intelligence, uh, has a recent article in which the title is something like uh, the U.S. created ISIS. He says, I don't mean that Washington sat down and planned ISIS. It's just that the actions that were taken in Iraq steadily led to the emergence of uh, utterly monstrous uh, uh, outgrowth, which is a kind of an extremist fringe of the already extremist Wahhabi ideology that Saudi Arabia has promulgated uh, both ideologically and with funding already extremist within Islam, and this is an extremist fringe of that, uh, which is, uh, you know, unfortunately, it's uh, the situation in Iraq and Syria is so chaotic and destructive that it apparently people are willing to accept the rule of ISIS, horrible as it is, it, if it at least imposes a bit of order. It rather, it, what, like what happened in Afghanistan when the Taliban came. Uh, people hated them, but they were welcomed because it was an improvement over the, uh, the terrible uh, destructiveness and chaos caused by the warlord uh, uh, conflicts.